And these nurses were started their strike about a few minutes ago, and they plan to be on strike for two days. They're demanding more benefits, not only for them and their families, but also for their patients. They say more safety measures need to be in place to protect themselves and their patients amid a COVID-19 pandemic. Shalon Matthews is a registered nurse here at New Rochelle Montefiore Hospital. Why is it so important for you to be out here striking this morning? We're out here for the patients. Our main concern is patient safety. Without the resources and the staff that we need, we can't deliver safe patient care to, our, to the community. Now, there's about 200 of you nurses who are going to be out striking. We know that contract negotiations are in place, and there are some wage increases that have been announced in your contract, but is that not good enough? Uh, the wage increases are over a three-year period, um, but that's not why we're here. Our main concern is patient safety. So what, what are you not getting at the hospital that you say is, is a must? More staffing. More staffing. The nurse-to-patient ratio is outrageous here. Uh, we don't have enough RNs. We don't have enough tech. We don't have enough ancillary staff and support. Uh, nurses find themselves running around doing everything from transporting patients to giving meds to caring for the patients to taking them to tests because it's just not enough staff. And you know, we hear your messages of save lives and you know, help the patients, and that's what you're chanting out here today. But you being out here, does that jeopardize the patients who are inside the hospitals? Uh, we've been in negotiations for two years now. Um, we gave Montefiore 10 days to come to a fair contract for us nurses, and uh, they continue to decline any any needs that we've asked for in, 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 in the past, and they continue to do so today. As of last night, they said that we do not need any more staffing, and they're not giving us any more staffing. So that's, that's what brings us here today. All right, Shalon Matthews, thank you so much. You're welcome. Back to the strike. I appreciate your time. Certainly some very frustrated and concerned nurses out here throughout this strike period. Uh, now the hospital says a contingency plan is in place, including uh, taking patients from this hospital to other area hospitals if need be, but the hospital is still very much open. It's a very latest from New Rochelle, Rebecca Solomon, PIX11 News.